Hello everyone. Welcome. In this video, we'll be walking you through how to reset your Xfinity Home Security touchscreen. This is a helpful skill to have if you're experiencing problems with your system. Sometimes, a simple reset can fix minor glitches and get everything working smoothly again. Let's get started. First, let's talk about why you might need to reset your touchscreen. Common reasons include the screen freezing, slow response times, or issues connecting to your Xfinity Home Network. Before you begin, make sure you have your master keypad code handy. You'll need this to access the settings menu. Now, let's move on to the actual reset process. There are generally two types of resets you can perform, a soft reset and a factory reset. We'll start with the soft reset, as it's the less drastic option. To perform a soft reset, first, locate the power button on the side or back of your Xfinity home touchscreen. Press and hold this power button for about 10 to 15 seconds. The screen should go black. Wait a few moments, and then press the power button again to turn the touchscreen back on. This is similar to restarting your phone or computer. It simply reboots the system. Check if this resolves your issue. If the soft reset doesn't fix the problem, you might need to perform a factory reset. Keep in mind that a factory reset will erase all your custom settings and preferences. This includes saved user codes and sensor configurations. It will restore the touchscreen to its original factory settings. To perform a factory reset, first, tap the gear icon on the touchscreen to access the settings menu. You'll need to enter your master keypad code to proceed. Once you're in the settings menu, look for an option like system reset, factory reset, or something similar. The exact wording may vary slightly depending on your touchscreen model. Tap on the reset option. A warning message will appear. This message will inform you about the consequences of performing a factory reset. Read the message carefully and confirm that you want to proceed. You might be asked to enter your master keypad code again to confirm your decision. The touchscreen will then begin the reset process. This may take a few minutes. Do not interrupt the process. Once the reset is complete, the touchscreen will restart. You'll need to go through the initial setup process again. This includes connecting to your Wi-Fi network and reconfiguring your sensors and user codes. That's it. You've successfully reset your Xfinity Home Security touchscreen. We hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching. If you found this video useful, please consider liking it and subscribing. Leave a comment below if you have any questions.